What is the crack, lads? We are back. Episode 5 of Dream Team Chronicles is going to be kicking off with a couple of uh, Dream Team division matches. We're going to be playing with the Barcelona past and present squad. But a lot of you guys enjoyed the other event as well that we had on. I think we've only two days left to play in that. So we're going to do a little bit of a mix-up from last episode. We're actually going to do the divisions first. Um, and we're going to get a game or two in, hopefully. And then we are going to, if we have time, hopefully, we're going to try and do one of the other matches in uh, with our normal uh, squad as well uh, to get those events. Because we do need a win in that event. Um, but yeah, V1.1.2 launched today. We've got a couple of new things, such as the Bayern Munich Legend Agent. I don't know if I'm going to spin, lads. Number one, I don't need any of the players and I can't play any of the players because we're using the Barcelona past and present squad. Um, but again, I mean, Beckenbauer, yeah, he would be a huge upgrade uh, to my kind of centre-back partnership at the moment. But with Van Dijk, Maldini and Piol, I don't know would he actually... Yeah, well, I mean, who am I kidding? He would be a rock. He's one of the best players in the game. Um, but yeah, I mean, other than that, we do have a free spin, so we might get him with him. But yeah, we're going to go into this. We do have a few coins, obviously. Um, and we still have the, the European club, so that's just been rinsed and repeated as well there. So you've got another chance to get them with the free five-star nominated contract. Same with them. Um, and then Villarreal is ending in three days, and we are going to be getting the Real Madrid uh legend agent actually so yeah we can take a look at that here two seconds i'll give you a look at that all right lads so they are the club agents coming it is a real madrid club featured agent coming on uh, monday the i think it's monday the 4th of july um and as you can see there you've got courtois benzema all the boys modric rodrigo vinnie jr Valverde, Militao, Camavinga. Um, there is obviously a couple of them coming as well, but like we're not going to be really uh, looking to, to get those guys unless we decide to do a past and present Real Madrid squad. So let me know in the comments below what you guys would like to see. But we are going to spin this, and as I said then, we're going to go straight into a past and present division match with Barcelona. We're going to buy one or two players as well because we won again the last, uh, the last match as well. So we are going to be buying somebody, but let's see who we get here. Brazilian three star no good to me a oh, goalkeeper even even worse oh he's Cassio though I remember that guy in Master League from a couple of years back not bad speaking of Master League keep an eye out for a very special video dropping either today or tomorrow lads I am buzzing for it I cannot wait um so yeah we'll try and put a bit of a spin on something to keep the Master League spirit alive on the channel but yeah we are going to go in and actually sign a player that a few people have told me about him right so he's playing with Barcelona obviously so he fits the bill um and it is a winger now he can only play left or right wing um shout out to to one of the guys in the comments who is literally bombarding me with messages to buy abde i've looked at this kid before he's really 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 decent stats like he's got 74 dribble and 74 acceleration he's got 53 levels to go up to um he's got a lovely face as well uh, as in he's got a real facing game um and he's a very decent player lads i mean i think we're going to buy him obviously we want to be signing up players um, I could be could be signing better players, obviously, but this guy goes up to, I think, I think he goes up to, all right, so there are his stats there. He goes up to an 84 overall, but as I said, we are going to try out a couple of different players. Not bad acceleration, really good dribbling. Um, we will have him 99 on out wide formation as well, but we'll see how he goes. We'll see how he goes. Obviously, it's all about testing out some things and you guys driving the driving the series forward with the uh, with the different players and stuff but yeah we're going to go straight into division match lads and i will see you at kickoff in just a couple of minutes all right lads, so we are in a match i've got the light on me today now so the, the bright lights are on the pressure is on but we are going to be checking out our squad they have fixed a couple of the issues dembele is down again man what is going on with him did the wife leave him or something what's going on he's down all the time man i can't depend on him at all like i might as well have nobody there and I don't have a right midfielder either that I can really... Do you know what? Do you know what I'm going to do now? Let's see this guy's team, actually. I'm getting sick of Dembele, lads. I feel like the real-life Barcelona team now, or if you're a fan of Barcelona. This guy's got a fairly... Oh, he's got Beckenbauer straight off the rip. What are the odds? I mean, he must have opened. Oh, my God. This is so laggy, man. I couldn't tip off there. Oh, no, it's grand. Making excuses already. This guy's going to be super aggressive now. Super aggressive. So it's just about beating his press. Oh, no, not that De Jong. Oh, that's all right. Let's see. Pedri's back to his old tricks. 
This guy's going to be super aggressive. Oh my god, why are you doing that? Cut in, cut in. Oh, hey, Jordy. Come on. Oh no, the dodgy touch again, the input delay. Oh, Romario. Oh, that's super frustrating, Les. Get up, Bucky! Super, go the whole way now. Uh, Mbappe is. <laughs> Brilliant goal. I was just standing up watching him, really. I was paying too much attention to Araujo, and Mbappe can just punish you like that. He's got Romario and check on the bench as well to come on and spring an offside trap. If he needs so. I should have scored that chance with him with Romario, man, but I don't know, man. I'm getting sick of complaining about it. That's it. Messi. Messi. Ah. Oh Jesus, it's back at this again now. It's back at this again. And the thing I'll say is, like, I don't know if the gameplay is the same for him. It's not his fault that I'm struggling with these issues. It's his fault for doing that now, all right? Look at that, man. I mean, again, I don't know what I'm meant to do, like, seriously. I just don't know what I'm meant to do. Yeah, get out of the way. Bappy doesn't want to know about it. Ah, uh, it was a good idea, but bad pass. Don't tell me the game is after quitting. Don't tell me after all of that, the game is after quitting. Well, it would just sum up the connection issue. What is going on? Like, server disconnection? If I lose three points for that now, with 40 minutes left in the game, I'm going to be raging. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, no. Don't say he quit, or don't say he disconnected, man. That is ridiculously bad. Oh, man. <laughs> what the hell? Oh no. Oh my complaining. And I just get handed a free win. So lads, I don't know what happened in that game, but as I said to you, I was complaining the whole match. It was it was super weird. It was super laggy, super kind of unresponsive. And I the last couple of matches I played in episode three and four, I was actually having a good time with the gameplay. Like or yeah, the last couple of matches I played. Um let's see this guy's team. Oh man, he's got a serious team. He's got a serious team. So he bought the City pack and he bought the Bayern pack and then he must have got free Salah as a legend. He bought Son and Kante. Yeah, this is going to be a tough game as well, lads. But let's see who's up for the challenge with the boys now. I think Jordy's going to come back in again. Oh, Dembele, you're up! He must have got a bit last night, lads. He must have got his bit last night. I'll buy you Dembele, boy. That's what we want. We just want to unleash Dembele, lads. Although this guy has a... This guy's playing a 4-3-3, so I can't really play a 3 at the back. Lads, I knew Dembele had a smile on his face when he came into the dressing room this morning. I knew. I knew there was something up with him, boy. Huh? He better, he better score today, lads. He definitely better produce the goods because he'll be gone. We'll just replace him. And, like, ugh, man, he's, he's so good to play with, but he just never, I don't know, he never, like, never is up, like. He's never up on, on top form. This is going to be a tough game, though. I know it already. Hello. Good. Yeah, man, this game is way fluider. I can feel it already. Way more, way more fluid. Oh, I didn't believe I go on over that. Open up those legs. 
Oh, oh Neuer! I hate that animation, lads. It just goes up into the air like forever. I should have put that across sweaty. Why, Jordy? Come on. Keep running, Pedri. Coming to you. Oh, I was trying to get that fin stunning shot. Yeah, lads, this game feels so fluid and smooth. Fluid and smooth. Especially defensively. Look at that. Some difference. I know I give away a free, but at least I, it's my own mistake. And it's not me struggling with the, with the angles. Look at that. Oh, no. Oh, I didn't mean that. Ah, no, I think I was offside and, and the wing. <sighs> what a save for Stegen. Belly, lads. Come off. No. Pedri. Oh, it's brilliant. Absolutely rattle that one. <laughs> Pedri lads, if that had gone in, it would have been some bruiser. Here we go. Oh, he's seen that before. He's seen that before. Or else he just got lucky. Oh, I need to make it. Getting dicey, lads. Neymar. Neymar! Boom! It's what he does. What a goal. Oh, man. Better let me watch that now. That was a clip wordy clip. Ah, oh, come on. doing it for me today I tell you that I'm really stepping up to the four Edri oh come on oh Romario it's there though nah oh, it's brilliant from Buki lads he's unreal Buki hold oh, on Piol put your arse in front of it come on now Pedri don't let the team down oh aye Pedri bye lads there's some bottle in this team oh look at Pedri Bele. Spin him, Romario. And the finish. Oh, Neymar. Oh, I would have loved that goal, lads. It was brilliant play. Messi. Ah, oh, took the wrong touch. He can't, he can't get a pass Buki at all. That man again, Neymar, lads. That magic on the wing, and it's 2 0. <clears throat> we will take it. Someone's messaging me. It's Pep. He wants to sign me up on the wing. He wants to sign me up on the wing. Messi's going to win this, watch. Oh, Pedri does. Lads, Pedri's feet. You've no idea how good he is. No, on your bike then, Bele. Or Neymar. Oh, that's Neymar is unreal today, isn't he? Neymar. Oh, lads, he's so good at those finesse shots. Don't want to get caught in the break, lads. That's the big thing. Rodinho. Yol. Or we can just finish it off! What a goal. Lads, sometimes I like to do that as well, right? This guy would have saw my team. I'm not saying that I'm a tactical genius now or anything, but 
he would have saw my team and thinking, right, I'm gone blue, I'm 2 nil up, I go 5 at the back. It doesn't mean that you have to, you know, just pass it around the back. You know, because he's going to think that I'm, that's all I'm going to do. And you can actually use that to your advantage and play a bit of mind games. That's up for Buki, lads. No, De Jong. Ah, De Jong's had... Lads, De Jong, try him at centre-back. He's so good. And as for this man, Pedri. You won't find much better than him. Ansu. Look at Pedri, lads. Touch Ansu. Oh, Ansu. Oh, you're killing me. Romario. Oh, Romario. I'm just playing with him now. I'm like a cat playing with, playing with a string. Ah, oh, beautiful lads. We do get promotion and it's a worthy promotion. That was some win. What a game. Probably didn't deserve 4-0. Probably deserved maybe like a 2-0. But those two goals we got towards the end were, were very fortunate. But uh, yeah, that was, a, that was a spectacular game from Neymar, lads. He just he practically won me the game, really, being 100% honest. And we're up, baby. We are up again. We're going straight up, back to back to back to back to back to back to back. We're into Division 4. We had a draw and four wins. And I don't know what happened in the last game where we got that 3-0 win. But we will take it, lads, and uh, we're going to skip onto this, and then we're going to go back out, and we're actually going to do something that a lot of you guys have been asking for ages. We are going to do our team numbering and our numbers. So that's going to end this episode. So, yeah, I've been watching the comments as who, sh who should get different numbers or whatever. I think I'm going to give my starting 11 the first 11 shirts, unless it's a, a, spe a special number. So we are going to start with Neymar. Obviously, he plays with number 10. But we are actually going to give him number seven because I think he's more of a traditional kind of number seven that I play him, like a winger, like a George Best type player. Ter Stegen's going to get number one for this squad. Araujo can stay at number three. We're going to put Piol at number five. We're going to put De Jong. Because he's playing at the back, we're going to put him at six. We don't have anyone for two at the moment, but we'll put him at six. Buki, we're going to put at... Well, Buki is usually five. But we might put Bucky actually at... Pedri, I'll leave Pedri at 16. We might put Bucky, lads. Let me know about Bucky. I don't know. Will I keep him at... F I could put him 6 and De Jong 8. I think that's what I'll do. Yeah, we'll put Bucky and uh, De Jong. We'll switch them. So De Jong can go 8 and Bucky can go 6. And then we will put Dembele... Dembele, I'm still out on Dembele, lads. I'm not going to lie, but I'm going to give him number 23 for the time being. Pedri will stay 16. Ronaldinho, let's see what's available for Ronaldinho. Uh, 9, 10, 11. Yeah, we'll give Ronaldinho 11. We'll give Messi number 10. We will give Andres Iniesta 17. We'll give Romario number 9. We will give Dani Alves number... Two. Oh, I have four as well there. I could swap that. Actually, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to swap De Jong and put him number four. And then I'm going to put... Um, who did I say there? Who did I say? Number six. Neymar, seven. Messi, ten. Ronaldinho, eleven. Yeah, that's it. That's fine. I'll put Maradona. Number eight. Jordi Alba can go stay 22. Zlatan, 19. Peakers, 12. Is that it, lads? You be happy with that? Any changes, lads, let me know. Is, Mar is uh, Messi our number 10? Is Messi our number 10? That's the big question. Because in fairness, Neymar has been absolutely brilliant for us since we got him. But let's see what happens. Let's see. So that is the squad. But yeah, lads, I'm going to end it there. A bit of a shorter episode today. Um, but we got a lot of stuff done. And obviously, we will be back with another episode quite soon where we'll be playing with our normal squad and finish off the events and stuff. But uh, yeah, I've also got, as you guys have probably seen by now, we have started a PES 2013 Master League. That is right. We've come back to PES 2013. I've been talking to a lot of people about what content they'd like to see. And a few said that a Master League would either PES 2013 or PES 2015. 
So we are going to be doing and moving on to PES 15 eventually, but we have started with PES 2013. We have an unbelievable option file on the PS3 version of the game. Um, and hopefully you guys enjoy that series and continue to, to, to watch that series because I do have huge plans for classic content, especially with PES Uni, uh, with the option files and stuff. Um, and yeah, yeah, we'll have some news on a lot of other stuff quite soon as well that I can't share at the moment, but we're working on. So that is it for me, lads. Make sure and check out the rest of the episodes. I'll be back quite soon. I hope you're enjoying this series, lads. Let me know in the comments below anything you want to see improved, anything you think is, uh, is fine or that you're enjoying. Let me know what the crack is. And uh, yeah, have a good weekend, lads. I will talk to you in a bit.